Hi guys. Oh, that's loud. Uh, so my name is Magnus Arving. I'm the CEO and co-founder of Intention. And at Intention, we develop interaction with robotic assets in extended realities and in space. So the problem is nested. Human-machine interfaces were made for the machines, and we're trying to make it more human. For NASA, they need the ability to interact with robotic assets in space. And that capability simply doesn't exist yet for the astronaut. NASA themselves have stated that making human-robot interaction efficient, effective, and natural is crucial to the success of sustained space exploration. And one of the most important elements of a successful return to space is creating capable spacesuits. So at Intention, we have been working with a spacesuit manufacturer for the past two and a half years, uh, where we first validated and then implemented our technology into prototypes of next generation spacesuits during the NASA Hot and Mars project field tests. So we're in a great position to actually deliver tech that can go to the moon. How does our solution work? We use hand motion uh, and gestures combined with voice commands and eye tracking to allow the astronaut to interact with and control robotic assets such as drones, rovers, and robotic arms. We created the Astronaut Smart Glove, a sensor-based glove which will read uh, the motions of the astronauts, and that can be implemented directly into the spacesuit. We have uh, had a lot of traction recently, uh, participated in the NASA Hot Mars project, uh, received a couple of grants uh, and uh, a few PR uh, stunts. So far, we have raised 1.4 uh, million euros, half equity, half grants, and we're looking to raise our seed round early next year. But the biggest thing, uh, we secured uh, our first large paying customer just a couple of weeks ago, uh, and that's, uh, that's the big news of today. We understand that space is niche, uh, but there is a viable business opportunity here because we need new spacesuits right now. So we use space as a means to de-risk our operations and create our technology uh, to the point where we can then take it back to Earth into more scalable markets. We've received uh, or uh, completed most of our milestones this year, uh, published fi our field test from this summer, uh, received the paying customer, uh, and are now working on the two new interactions. So our seed round uh, is going to be used to secure our IP through patenting, uh, to expand on our space uh, operations, and re reach terrestrial market validation. We're an awesome team of visionaries, engineers, dreamers, doers, uh, business professionals, uh, and we're supported by serial entrepreneurs and planetary scientists uh, Dr. Pascal Lee, the chairman of the NASA Hot Mars Project. Uh, so we're set up for success. Really, we are in a unique position to deliver astronaut technology, and we're already delivering interaction systems and robot robotic asset manipulation services today. We have a strong team and great traction. We're looking for partners, uh, customers, and investors uh, coming up. We're raising a million pounds, so 1.2 million euros, uh, 100K now. That's Numbers are outdated, but we are fulfilling that round within a couple of weeks. Thank you very much.